Sydney Rowing Club Australia against Malsey Boat Club in the Wifold Challenge. Darting off the start past Temple Island. And a bit further down in the race, how are the Australians getting on here? Doing very nicely there. Three quarters of a length lead, the Australians on the Berkshire station at the top of your picture. Good morning to everybody from Sydney watching this one. It's a good afternoon to you, isn't it? 6.15 in the afternoon in Sydney, and I'm sure there'll be friends and family watching. You'll be pleased with what you're seeing, but Mulsey Boat Club with a push there, they and they definitely made it a back move level, haven't they? Yeah, really interesting, because um, Fran Timmerand, he was the Mulsey coach. He's gone over to Sydney, having been there in the past, so Mulsey will know exactly what Sydney have done. And, of course, Mulsey now being looked after by Samuel Tuck. They'll have their own idea, so they will know what um, France's idea is for the race and how to work work it through it. Mulsey have done a really, really good tap push through that part of the race. It's flat, it's efficient. Uh, Sydney, they're sticking in there, though. Um, this, this one could go all the way. This is one of my ones to watch this morning, and I was excited to, to say how these two crews matched up against each other. Well, it's proved to be the case, isn't it? It's a cracking race. Sydney will not be keen to exit at this stage. Conditions a little bit different to the Parramatta River, where they train. And they have got some work to do here against Molsey Boat Club, who, of course, know this stretch of the water so well. The atmosphere picking up. Sydney Rowing Club right in the race. Molsey Boat Club leading just. You can see in the bow seat there, Samuel Bodkin. Former Forley Cup winner, so he's been through all the way to Sunday when he was with Windsor Boys School and got his way through. But just looking now, Tim, this steering, these are coxless balls. You can see the, the umpire there is just saying, Molsey, get over. Because what I noticed was Sydney went quite close to the booms on the Berkshire side, that blue boat, and they steered away from it a bit. They're very safe there, they look good around that. But I think it meant that Molsey followed them a little bit and found that they were uh, warned by the umpire. <laughs> the umpire, Grimbatten there, she's got the boat right up with there because she knows this can be, is going to go all the way. This is going to be an amazing race. Molsey just taking the advantage now. Your pre-regatta call comes true. It was a great race. Fantastic entertainment. Sydney digging in deep. I think they've got too much to do, but they are having a really good go at Molsey as they head in front of Stewart's. This is going to be a very tight finish because Sydney's still pouring on the pressure. But Molsey have a little bit more and they come again and there they are over the line. Molsey through in the Wifold Challenge Cup. And for the Australians, their regatta over very early in the week. But terrific race. And they'll have, uh, I'm sure, enjoyed that experience. What an experience. The Wifold Challenge Cup. And uh, well done to both boats there, serving up some serious entertainment. Yeah.